Hi guys, how's it going? Something a little bit different today? Me and my good bud Wrath Victory collaborated on a tune. He's a badass guitarist from Australia and we decided to make some metal for you, using a mix of free stuff and premium stuff to show the amazing options we have available these days. He wrote and recorded the guitar, bass and drums, then I wrote and recorded the vocals and all the lead guitar. Stick around after for both of us talking through what we used. This tune is called Subhuman and it's coming up next. Yeah. 
Alright guys, cheers for watching. Just want to say thanks out to Resington on this one for the collaboration. I'm really stoked with the way the tune turned out. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Uh, so let's just cover the tones real quick. On the left hand side I use the Ignite Amps Emissary and on the right hand side I use the Fort Nameless Suite. Um, so the whammy pedal is just DI straight into my interface for everything. Um, yeah, I don't want to pit these plugins against each other. Really just trying to outline how great the tones are these days from the free VSTs we can get our hands on. So for the emissary, I use the uh, Effector Silencer. This is a free noise gate VST. Followed by the Ignite Amps Tyrant Screamer Overdrive. Followed of course by the Emissary. This is the STL Tones version 2. And I'm using the Ignite Amps IR Loader. I'm just on the 441 Modern preset. And I think I just pushed the level of the room up a little bit. So I did somewhat profile this Emissary Tone on my Fortin Nameless preset. So hence this EQ. And I should mention that I have both these amp sims running into a uh, parent track with high and low pass filters and notching out uh, various sort of other nasty frequencies. So moving on to the Fortin Nameless Suite. And uh, what can I say? All the neural DSP stuff is just amazing. Um, they did AB this Fortin Nameless plugin against the real amp head on their YouTube channel. Um, so yeah, go check that out. So here we have the pedal section. We've got the Zool and the Hex Drive. Of course, the Grind and the Cab section. So just to cover the clean tones real quick, I used the Ignite Amps Profet and I just went for like a pushed clean sort of sound. This is the uh, Ignite Amps Power Amp. Followed, of course, by the IR loader. And uh, Resington actually gave me some advice on reverb and put me onto the sound from reverb. This is a free reverb plugin, and yeah, I'm stoked with the ambient tones I got out of this one. All right, guys, so I'll just uh, play back the emissary tone, followed by the nameless tone, and you guys can have a listen and see what you think. guys thanks for watching let me know what you guys think in the comments and consider subscribing cheers hi guys i just want to say thanks to wrath victory for writing a badass tune for me to scream and play lead over i made up with how it turned out i'll quickly go over my lead guitar chain as well as both vocal chains which i've never covered before so here it is i went with the crunch man by nalex for the lead tone probably my favorite free amp vst at the moment i went with an old ola ir which seemed to pair pretty well with the crunch man the Mercurial Chorus to give the lead some stereo width and to make it swim a bit. Then the Samford Delay, I've been using this a lot. You can set the delays left and right at different intervals. Love this sound. Then some EQ. Right, here's the dirty vocal chain. All the tracks are going through this master. I've got the Audio Assault Head Crusher, the free version. A great saturator that just gives my screams a little bit more oomph. Then some pretty standard stuff, a de EQ, Comp, and finally, the Valhalla Freak Echo. Here's the clean vocal master, pretty standard stuff, EQ, de comp. And then again, I've got the Mercurial Chorus. This thing just works great on anything, and it's giving these vocals more width, and it's filling up more space. Then the Valhalla Freak Echo again, for some epic sounding trails. And finally, everything is going through the last three stages I showed on my Mastering Metal in Reaper video. This track is available for free. Go download it, go subscribe to Wrath Victory, and follow him on Instagram. All links down below. Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. And subscribe if you want to see more metal stuff. I'll be back soon with a video on something else. So until then, ciao.